this is Char speaking from Charlie's Angel Tarot and this is the card for the 17th of June 2020. I hope you're all well and I hope you are going to have a beautiful day today. I've made a video before I, and uploaded that before this video and wow the first card I was just reading it whilst I was um, editing, editing it and it is amazing it is has a lot of relation to the video I have made I made a reaction a video a reaction video on a video that I watched today uh, bear witness and take action so I hope you go and have a look at that one and then you can understand what I mean that the first card in any way resembles to the second and the third card. I haven't uh, got to the th second and the third card yet but the wild woman yes she takes action and com uh, completion something will be completed and the w where there is an end there is also a new beginning so let's hope there is a new beginning of understanding respect equality of life in general the first card is get the giveaway and it is somebody holding their arms out to heaven and you can see sort of wings and I th like the angel wings asking help from the angels beautiful card and you've got also planets around her or in front of her so it could be also asking help and understanding from different planets different uh, civilizations cosmoses who knows they, I love these cards they're right here and now and they're right in your face and they're also including the overall good and the overall good is for mankind and the environment for all of us and for our higher selves and the divine and the angels that is when I say for the uh, um, overall good that is what I mean now the essence of the first card is the give away that is what the name is and the giveaway is a gift you offer to life and also to others I think without attachment without expecting anything back you can only give that what is truly yours and I don't mean a jumper or anything that you don't want anymore but I mean respect a smile how are you an encouraging encourage uh, an encourage encouraging comment to somebody else like I said last week in one of my readings just say hello and make somebody's day you don't know what happens behind closed doors a gentle touch and a gentle kind word is more than enough this is not giving to others what you don't longer need this is something that comes from your heart and that's where it should come from this is one of the most precious and authentic gifts that you can give with genuine feelings now the invitation for today is make a list of 10 people and things for which you are grateful connect with the feeling of gratitude the giveaway comes to and asks you to feel the same gratitude without needing anything or anyone to inspire it and to share this gratitude with those you meet and who are around you as you offer thanks your heart opens and you start realizing how much life has given you you heal your feelings and a scarcity and open yourself to abundance that surrounds you the giveaway invites you to be in the flow of life as you freely and 
uh, you give freely and receive freely so it's the, like the six of uh, pentacles give and take my share card so share your energy positive energy with somebody else don't look at what you don't have but realize what you do have wow that's a beautiful message okay so that comes to respect and that also comes close to equality give the quality of your of you to somebody else give somebody else equality now we have the wild woman like i said let your inner child come out be wild be bold be bold today by doing things like that when the wild woman appears into your reading or in on your day if you pull her that just one card she reminds you of the essence of authenticity and freedom and yes be bold stand up for your freedom say what you feel and say what you think stand up for what you believe you the f we need to keep our freedom divested of all social constraints and cultural conformity the wild woman holds up a mirror to your essential self the true essence of who you are and who you are meant to be she is a reminder of the bright light within each of us that gets dimmed by restrictions imposed upon us by the expectations of society or municipalities or institutions that's my words my darlings not the words of the author she reminds us that it is that in order to be fully present to life we must uncover the light and let the, it shine brightly regardless of perceived consequences yes dare to speak out and also try to preserve wh where you, what you believe in be in the present she reminds us that in order to be fully present in life we must uncover the untruths and bring out the truth and stand by the truth protect the truth and protect ourselves and others when the wild woman comes to dance in your reading you are invited to shine brightly and to know that your true true self is being called out to engage into the world or with the world this is a symbol that your long-term long-held dream is beginning to take root and wants to express and wants to be expressed you need to express yourself in other words you've been holding in your ideas or feelings for too long your authentic self doesn't fit in this situation or box nobody should be put into a box it needs freedom to shine and also you need freedom to develop and grow and shine brightly today so dance and abandon your old self beliefs and be bold go out there and decide what you want and how you want it fight for it and you'll be happy because the happiness will come to you if you take part with your inner self and your higher self for all higher good so believe in what you believe in stand for what you believe and do the dance i get to hear you can do the talk so do and you want to do the walk or you're doing the walk the dance in other words so do the talk and then we've got completion yes once you've spoken your mind and know how to say it as best as you can watch your intonation don't get angry or aggressive 
just speak out for what you want and for what you believe in then something will come to completion and you will be a new person because you've brought it out into the open all things have a beginning a middle and an end this is the n nature of life the seed the flower and the fruit and of all human relationships completion suggests the fullness of the moment and the need to transform an old form into a new one boom the invitation you have finished a cycle and there is no more growth or benefit from hanging on to the old in regard to relationships it is time to honor what has been and find a new form for the future in your ventures it is time to reap your harvest completion is a time for celebration so you need to dance it is the end of the summer when the fruit is ripe so when if you interact and you give away a smile a how are you can I do anything for you where are you going to if you interact with other people you might be making somebody felt feel um, uh, recognized or liked you make somebody's day start better come together don't let anybody tell you what to do or walk over you walk away from other people's drama but make somebody's day you've got tw 23 so that's a five you might be out of balance and if somebody does that to you then you will be back in balance because you've got 62 and that's eight then you'll be back in your strength because you've got the recognition somebody said something to you you've interacted exchanged positive energy and now you can do the dance you can do the walk and the talk you pass it on to somebody else make somebody else's day and so things come to an end and where there is an end there is a new beginning number nine an ending a new beginning I hope you've enjoyed the reading for today the 17th of June and I hope you have a lovely day and you can watch my reaction to a YouTube video um, as I stand for love, respect, honesty and clarity and being of service to others. And I, there's no advertisements in that video because I've switched them off and I wish to be heard and be known that I love everybody so long they don't hurt anybody else so make somebody's day today that is the message love you and see you tonight take care